Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to change the front brake pads on this 2010 Chrysler Town & Country. It's the same as the Dodge Grand Caravan. If this video is helpful, you smash that thumbs up button and leave a comment down below. It really helps out a lot. First thing we're going to do, crack loose our lug nuts, jack up the vehicle, take off the tire. Next thing we're going to do is break loose our slide bolts. So this one right here, this one right here, and take those out. Now we can pry our caliper out, just like that. Pry it right off, and we'll set it off to the side somewhere. Now we can take these out, just kind of wiggle like this. Take it out, same with the back one. And we can slide our new ones in there. If you've got new hardware, which is this metal uh, clip right here that slides in, you can pop these out and put new ones in there. I'm just gonna leave my old ones there because I didn't get new ones with my set. Now we're gonna take these off so you can kind of twist and pull on that boot, pop that boot off. And then we're gonna re-grease this, this slide. Same thing with this one down here. And all you need to do is get yourself some braking caliper grease like this and we'll coat that slide i'll have amazon links in the description below where you can get a new set of pads and uh, some caliper grease and some stuff that might be handy last thing we're going to do before we put it back together is push the piston caliper the caliper piston back into the caliper so i've got this brake tool also linked in the description below um, basically you just got this, uh, plate that slides on here and then, uh, an adapter right here, which is just a circle disc and you just start turning and you just push that caliper back or the piston back into the caliper. Um, after you're done with that, you just, if you haven't put your brake pads back on, put your brake pads back in there, slide the caliper back over and put it back together. Uh, put those two bolts back in um, After you've done the other side go and push the brake pedal down a few times until you feel them get stiff and Then you're good to go. That's all there is to it um, So if this video is helpful smash that thumbs up button leave a comment down below for the algorithm and have a good one